Hey, what's up, people from the internet? This is Chris with another replay of Nexus Wars for me. This time we have another replay from the tournament. And um, on team one, we're gonna have Gushi. And in team two, we're gonna have OPA. So, this is, I think, the winner's bracket from the group B, which I think it was the hardest group <coughs> of the tournament. <coughs> He had a lot of solid players, so I think in group in group B was um, full send and OPA, Liner and and Gucci. And in group A we were <laughs> sorry. Um, I'm gonna be muting my mic. It's just because. Have a little fun with you today. And I don't want to hear you sniffing and stuff like that. Also, I have a sip in my coffee. So, no more last game right now. And I was saying, Group A, we had Wannabe Alpha, Balthazar, um, Gianco, and I. So I'm down to watch this game, see what, what happens, I'm very curious. Uh, what I know from these guys is that they, oh, I, I have the sense that maybe I'm mistaking, you guys could let me know. But I think they practiced together quite a bit b previous to the tournament. <clears throat> so for me it's very fascinating to, to, to watch them play because, because yeah, I mean, uh, I find a different style. So OPA with the two Phoenix, I inter interrupt the air. Not having air control from the start, it's paying enough. And I think both players are having one pylon at 32, one upgrade. The medibikes healing those investors. <coughs> I think this is becoming a problem, the fact that he's losing air. Uh, these two guys are extremely solid. I think top five one v one players. <coughs> And right now, OPA is pushing pretty hard to the second ramp. Colossus come out, but Viper's still around <coughs> from uh, OPA. Morals are popping everything that is showing up, and it is the first nuke. So Gucci nukes for first time. Meanwhile, <coughs> still fighting for the for the ramp. And I have an issue with the placement. Yeah, this happened to me too. It makes it really hard to push. The second nook. And Brutal show up, this is a good move. Brutal Lord's pretty good against Colossus. <coughs> but Vikings are there. There's a very strong <coughs> rush. Excuse me. All right, Archangel comes out. I mean, OPA has been having a control of the early game from the start and is popping upgrades right now. Five attack on, on the Protoss units. And three attack from Gushi. Gushi is reacting to it pretty well. What a rush. 
and I think this is the push that killed me <laughs> because the, in the final I, I didn't last long at all up here it just smacked me I was completely nervous this is no excuse shit happens and he was the most solid player I've played so far well him and I can't all for forget I'll not mention even though he's a toxic person or for very toxic to what he have done to other players but Santi if you ever get if you ever had a chance to play against that guy in 1v1 uh, with Santi overtime gameplay is fucking sick <coughs> but the hero control wasn't there. So OPA has a great micro. So we're gonna get to see it here. And I really like his early early game was extremely solid in, in a Gucci struggle for a couple looks. <coughs> and just 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 to put Gucci to struggle like that. Oh boy! So we have a Sarah too? All right, and Gucci is gonna show up how his micro is made of. We're gonna see if he's gonna be paying off, but this is this is risky. Two hero control is not something you see every day. <laughs> there is the carry gun again. I think Gucci needs to Saratu to feel confident enough to dive in. The tempests are stacking right in the lower ramp, and the, the pressure is still there. No, that sucks. Oh, damn! So Gushina loses the archangel. He only have one Sera two. The tempests are in his ramp and carrying us. Coming up, three carry gun for Gucci. Second, second carry gun show up. Gucci have a chance with having a nice hat too, and killing the hero. The problem is maybe unit composition <coughs> could be an issue. If you have Brutlers, uh, you're using some of your income on, uh, some of your supply on. It is a hit only ground. So you might be behind on air units. <laughs> Go away. <laughs> oh, the Kerrigan was doing nutty stuff. He went for Archangel again. And now he have a tough homework on dealing with these units at his lower ramp. Like, I think the switch of some of the brutes is needed. They have only four brutes though. Oh no, Archangel is down again. I see this is a very difficult comeback for Gucci. A pressure that OPA put in this game from the start. Pretty sick. Scary as fuck. <laughs> yeah, I tell you, micro is pretty good. OPA is micro. I think this is game. Six attack. It does upgrades. Nine attack already at 30 damage unit. We have a lot of units also. Nine attack on Viking. Extremely fast.
And this is how it ends, I think. I'm just thinking how fast this guy is. is insane. GG. Very solid game to the final. Of, I think the first final, <laughs> let's say. The winner's bracket final. So, this was the next day. Anyways, guys, GG. I didn't talk much about uh, strategy because <clears throat> it was very interesting to see how aggressive Ope was from the start. And yeah, he wanted to finish this fast. And I think that's, that's his style. Very interesting. Anyways, GG's peace.